early morning. I don't know what day it is. Wednesday, I guess. And I am hiking these giants right now. Um, before I head to Oakland to hang out with Caroline and get into some trouble with her. But I just thought I would show you. I've always thought that these giant, like, hollowings of the trees um, are doorways for gnomes who live there. And I would say that this little trail that leads into that suggests that my theory is correct. I'm just saying. Little gnomes. Little tree gnomes. Just saying. about to walk through this little corridor of trees right here and I just love it. I think it's like the coolest thing in the world. I'm so like easily uh, entertained. Look at this, this is so cool. <laughs> oh, look at that, it's so fun. I kind of just want to go back and forth, back and forth. I'm so easily entertained. I don't know if that's even the right word. I don't think it is. I think it's just that I'm so like easily pleased by little things in nature. I don't know. I mean, I'm walking through the redwoods right now. You know, give me a break. What else did you expect? Did some yoga back there. Um, Cause I like to do yoga in different places and take pictures of it. Um, I'm getting ready to finish up this hike and then head to Oakland. Um, but I just wanted to kind of take a minute and look around how beautiful everything is. Now the sun is really coming up. You can kind of see everything a little more. It's not as ghostly and creepy as when the sun is first rising. Um, and I'm not even sure it was really creepy as much as it just felt very sad. You know, like all these other fallen trees or pieces of trees or things like this. It's beautiful and it's sad at the same time. You know, I can't explain or describe exactly what that is. I just know that this was really special for me and last night was very special. 
for me as well and for no real special reason. <laughs> it just, I look that has a face. <laughs> it's just been um, the culmination of a lot of things and last night was a pretty emotional evening for me. Um, and, but it was good because I sort of released that from my body and into the earth and the earth has taken it because that's what she does. Look, this is cool. Anyway, the earth has taken it and absorbed it because that's what she does and um, I'm feeling like a whole new person now. Much lighter in fact. So I guess I just wanted to kind of have this moment this morning with all these beautiful trees um, because they heard me last night and uh, I just owe them a thank you I suppose. So now that we're back at the car, one last look. And one last thank you. Do you have a thing? Oh, you have his. I no, I have mine. Okay. His thing is dead. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> I couldn't help it. Sorry. My camera's still not focusing. Well, you Are you sure? My beautiful Are you sure it's not you that's not focusing? Oh, it could be. I <laughs> have that drink. Because I was like... Wait, that's probably just my shoulder. Yeah, you're like, uh... <laughs> Do you happen to notice that there's a camera facing you? I would not know. <laughs>